Let's fix an iPhone 6s with extreme backlight damage. We'll briefly show you how your iPhone can end up looking like this. And how we're going to go ahead to repair it. By rebuilding the entire backlight circuit and making this iPhone 6s great again. Let's get started. This is an iPhone 6S backlight circuit. Capacitor C4023 was shorted to ground, which created so much heat that it destroyed two diodes, two coils, and also the main backlight driver. Uh, so much heat was actually created that even the connection point of the rail burned completely off the motherboard. This here is the same that we're looking at the schematic, but this is actually the motherboard. All the silver looking pads were all the bad components were originally soldered onto. And over here is where the real damage is, which makes its repair very challenging. Uh, as you can see, uh, this hole here should have a silver looking pad on it, but it's completely burnt off. And also this part of the line that you see here is missing, and it actually got so hot that the trace is now detached off the motherboard. So we're going to start by rebuilding the missing traces with, <clears throat> with micro wires. The micro wires will become our new connection points. These connection points will allow us to have something to solder our new components back onto the motherboard. This here is going to act as one of our pads. And we're just going to clean up the work area a little bit. And then we're going to go ahead and fix the other trace and the missing pad. And we're going to do all of this at the same time with just one wire. So this wire is going to help to secure the trace that was lifting. And we're also going to extend it since there's part of it that's uh, completely missing as well. And now with all the missing traces and pads replaced with micro wires, we can now go ahead and start to solder our new components back on the backlight circuit. We're going to start with the coils L4021 and L4020. Then we're going to replace who started all of this, which is C4023. And we're going to follow this with the two diodes D4021 and 4020. And finally, we're going to replace the backlight driver IC U4020. Now that everything is back into place, uh, the rework is going to be secured with a UV mask. So we're going to start by applying this UV mask and afterwards we're going to cure it under UV light for a few minutes. The UV mask is going to harden and it's going to help to secure our micro wires into place. And there we go, we're finally done. Now for testing, we're going to use this DC power supply. This is basically like a big adjustable battery that we're going to use to power the iPhone success. And we're going to use these tweezers to act as a power button since the board is not placed in the frame yet. And there we go, this iPhone 6S is now repaired. And we're also able to save all of the customer's data. Thank you very much for watching and have a good day.